Hey everybody, it's Chad from Grayscale Gorilla, and these are my top five free Windows utilities for motion designers. Hey everybody, it's Chad from Grayscale Gorilla, where we give you the tools, training, and tutorials to make you a better motion designer. Today's video is all about free Windows utilities. I get a lot of people asking me when they're switching from Mac to PC to take advantage of GPU rendering, what do I use for renaming, for image viewing, all that sort of thing. So I made a video to clear all that up and I'm giving you my top five free Windows utilities for motion designers. Be sure to subscribe down below as there's gonna be a lot more videos coming your way from Grayscale Gorilla. Let's get into the video. So number five, we've got Rain Meter. Rain Meter is a desktop customization tool for Windows. It's open source and it's made by a pretty dedicated community of artists and designers that have made really cool skins that you can download. The best part about it is it's free. So as you can see here, it's a really cool way to kind of like decorate your desktop with widgets and interesting information. You can see I've got my, I've got thermometers going for all my GPUs, I've got CPU monitors, I've got all this stuff rocking on my desktop, and there's so many different ways that you can customize it. It's really, really fun to kind of figure out ways of, of using Rain Meter to show you different parts of your system. My favorite part about this one is seeing my Spotify album art on my desktop. Really love that. Really love being able to see what I'm listening to, and I'm a big fan of album artwork, so it's a great one for me. All right, in fourth place, we've got XN View. XN View is a multimedia viewer for Windows. You can organize, view, and convert and rename all kinds of images. It supports nearly every file type imaginable. It's quite a bit faster than Bridge, in my opinion. Um, it also supports meta tags so that you can meta tag all of your images for quick search. It's free, which is amazing. Uh, my favorite part of this one is the batch conversion tool. You can easily convert an image sequence or an image to from one file format to another. Definitely a must have, XN view. Coming in at third, we've got Renamer. Renamer is a robust file renamer by Dennis Kozlov. It comes in a free light version, and then you can have a paid version, which has a few more features. You can easily create rules to fully control your renaming. You can add individual files or folders. You can preview your output before you commit to your rename. My favorite part of this one are the rules. The rules are really, really robust and easy to use and easy to create. So you could actually add suffixes, prefixes, replace words, uh, do go crazy with it. It's a lot of fun. In second place, we've got DJV. DJV is a really useful tool for motion designers who need to RAM preview image sequences like EXRs or TIFFs or something like that where you would normally have to open up After Effects or Fusion or Nuke to RAM preview. What DJV is, it's an open source image sequence playback system that uses your RAM. It's created by a guy named Darby Johnston. It's available in Windows, Mac, and Linux. And finally, in first place, we've got ShareX. ShareX is a really cool open source screenshot tool created by a dedicated team of contributors. It has a ton of useful features, including screen recording, screenshot workflows, and a lot more. The screenshot workflows, I can't stress enough how powerful those are. You can actually screenshot an area of your frame and it'll actually automatically upload it to Google or, or maybe your Google Drive or your Dropbox, and it'll save that URL to your clipboard so that you can easily paste it into a chat window or into an email. It's a really fast way of sharing your work and getting feedback. This is a definite must have. My favorite part of this one, how simple and fast it is to share screenshots. It is an amazing tool. I definitely recommend everybody pick this one up. Hey, welcome back. Thanks for watching. I hope it was useful for you. If you have any utilities that maybe I didn't cover that you think I should know about, hit me in the comments below. I'd love to hear about them. Also make sure you subscribe because we are gonna be posting a lot of videos in the next couple months and you don't wanna miss out. I'll see you next time. What do you think, Coop? How do we do? You do okay? Yeah? You approve?